Good morning. This is our last assembly this half term and our last assembly on the theme of responsibility. And this week's focus is I am responsible for my self-help. So what is self-help? Well, it's doing something for yourself and doing it independently. Or it might be expressing your needs independently. But sometimes self-help actually includes asking somebody else to help you. So in today's assembly, we're going to look at lots of different examples of things that you could do to help yourself. There are things that you can do for yourself that are related to hygiene or keeping clean. For example, can you wash your hands by yourself? Can you brush your teeth? Can you use the toilet and then remember to wash your hands afterwards? Can you shower or have a bath? Can you wash your hair independently? Or comb or brush your hair? If you're old enough, do you remember to use deodorant without being reminded? And if you sneeze or cough or blow your nose, do you remember to use a tissue and then put it in the bin? And then do you remember to wash your hands afterwards? I've just called this section clothes because it's related to things that you might do every day. And can you do them yourself related to clothes? Can you put your coat on or take your coat up? Can you fasten your coat? Can you get dressed by yourself or undressed when it's time to go to bed? Do you get dressed for the weather? Do you look outside and think, oh, it's going to be a cold day, so I need to remember some warm clothes? Or today it's going to be hot and sunny, so I need to make sure I'm wearing clothes that I won't get too hot in. Can you tie your shoelaces? And when you take your clothes off, do you put them in the wash basket, ready to be washed? There are some self-help skills related to health, so maybe you can do some of these. For example, do you get a good night's sleep? Do you eat healthy foods or are you willing to try new food? Do you drink enough water? Are you active? Do you do some sports? This one's related to mental health, but are you kind and helpful to others? Are you a good friend? And are you able to recognise and manage your emotions? This can be quite tricky, but it's a really important skill. So if you feel nervous about something, do you know how to calm yourself down? And are you able to play safely? Do you take responsibility for your self-help at school? Do you sit down on your chair for lessons? Do you get out equipment for lessons? And then do you put it away at the end? Are you a good listener? Do you listen to your friends? Do you listen in lessons? Do you always try your best? Do you try to do things on your own before you ask for help, for example? If you've got any rubbish, do you put it in the bin? And do you always try to behave well? Do you, do you display good behaviour? If you're going to live independently as you get older, you need to be independent for certain life skills. This might include cooking. Are you able to cook for yourself or get yourself some food? Can you go shopping and pay for something by yourself? Are you able to cross the road safely? Do you follow the green cross code? Can you put some washing in the machine and switch it on and then get it out and dry it? Are you able to tidy your house and keep it clean? And can you travel by public transport? Those are some examples of skills that you will need as you become an adult. A really important part of your, your self-help skills is going to be your communication. 
So how well do you, you use your communication skills and how independently do you use them? For example, are you able to use your PECS book? Do you think about it without the teacher telling you? Do you use Makaton signs? Do you try and speak clearly to express what you need? And this one's really important. How well do you listen to others? If you get stuck, are you able to ask for help? And are you able to ask for things that you want and need in class? So I've given you lots of examples of things that you might be able to do or you might be working towards this week. So see what you can do. And if you, there's something that you're nearly there with, just keep trying and show that you are responsible for your self-help.